What's up guys, this is part two of who I think should be in the WWE Hall of Fame this year. Go check out my last video if you haven't done so already to see who I think was the first person that should be inducted. As I've mentioned before, WrestleMania is in a few weeks over on April 6th and 7th. And as a tradition, the Hall of Fame is the night before. So the second person that I think should be in the WWE Hall of Fame this year is none other than Batista. When I first started watching Batista, it was in 2005 when he was the World Heavyweight Champion after defeating Triple H for it at WrestleMania 21. With Batista on SmackDown and John Cena over on Raw, WWE was unstoppable. The rivalry between him and Triple H was absolutely bananas and when I first started watching WWE, it was one of the greatest storylines I had seen at the time. Being part of one of the greatest stables of the early 2000s evolution. Batista would be active in the WWE from 2002 up until 2019 with several different breaks in between. Batista would go on to be a six-time world champion, four-time tag team champion, and two-time Royal Rumble winner, winning the 2005 and 2014 edition of the Rumble. Batista would eventually go into Hollywood and star in many different movies, with the biggest one being The Guardians of the Galaxy. I'm not even gonna lie, if you guys haven't seen the movie Stubert, it was actually a really good movie with him in it. I even got to meet him at a meet and greet. I don't have a picture of it because I was so young and I don't even think we have the picture or had the picture. I think Batista should be in the Hall of Fame. He entertained a lot of us during the Ruthless Aggression era and he just gave us so many different moments. And if there's anybody that should be inducting Batista, it should be Triple H. So what do you guys think about this? Should Batista be in the Hall of Fame this year? Let me know what you guys think down in the comments and make sure you're following for more wrestling content.